The month of December is dedicated to the Immaculate Conception and to Jesus. We will ask Infant Jesus to come into our hearts and bless this month of December with His innocence, His goodness, His mercy, and His blessing. So let us begin with the sign of the cross. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Prayer for the month of December Heavenly Father, Thank you for this beautiful month of December. I am sorry for all my sins during this year. Please forgive me. This is a very special month for us. This is the month when we celebrate the birth of our Savior, Lord Jesus Christ. This time of the year is beautiful, and I feel your presence even more. I love you so much, Lord Jesus and I am excited for all the celebrations for your birthday. Though this year, just like last year, may not be as grand as other years, you know the situation I and all others have been through this year. The loneliness, the suffering and the pain. It has not been easy for me and my family. We have been through a lot of difficulties and sorrows. Sometimes the cross feels too heavy to carry. But as we come to the end of this year, I believe my burdens will be lighter and your love will surround me. I entrust this month of December into your hands. Thank you for filling this month with your grace. Energize and bless this month, Lord. Fill me with your love and joy. May your spirit grow in me and be a blessing to others. In this new month of December, I pray that you open the floodgates of heaven and pour out a mighty blessing on me. I pray for your abundant blessings and favor that will protect me, guard me, and guide me on the right path. By seeing your mighty works in my life, may all people know that I belong to you and that you love me. In a special way, I pray for this particular blessing during this month of December. At this moment, please ask for everything you need and believe in your heart that you will receive it. Write it in the comments with complete faith in God. Thank you for listening to my prayer, Lord. Protect my family from all evil. Keep us in good health mentally, physically and spiritually. May our work bring you praise through everything we do during this month of December. Please bless me with success at work and help me do well in my job and my business. May my family and friends feel your presence when they meet me. Help me to be bold and to evangelize in your name when possible. Blessed Father, you are gracious and kind to me. From the depth of my heart, I am grateful for your infinite grace, mercy, wisdom, blessings, and power. Thank you for the gift of wealth, health, and bringing me this far. From January to December, the last month of this year, thank you for your protection, provision, and many other things you have done for me. The ones I know and the ones I do not know. I am very grateful. May the Lord have compassion on me and forgive all my debts during this new month of December. May I end this year better than when I started it. May my God bless me with great joy and peace. May the Lord surprise me in new ways that words cannot express. May His goodness and mercy reveal a new dimension of His glory to me. May songs of thanksgiving 
never cease from my heart and my mouth. May I lift up holy hands in joyful praise to the Lord during this month. Thank you for blessing this new month. I believe and declare that this month will be a month of joy, peace and victory. A month when I grow closer to my loved ones and keep God first place, now and forever. Amen. Now we will say a scripture verse about the birth of Christ and say a prayer to bless this new month. This is how the birth of Jesus Christ came about. His mother Mary was pledged to be married to Joseph, but before they came together, she was found to be with child through the Holy Spirit. Because Joseph, her husband, was a righteous man and did not want to expose her to public disgrace, he had in mind to divorce her quietly. But after he had considered this, an angel of the Lord appeared to him in a dream and said, Joseph, son of David, do not be afraid to take Mary home as your wife, because what is conceived in her is from the Holy Spirit. She will give birth to a son, and you are to give him the name Jesus, because he will save his people from their sins. All this took place to fulfill what the Lord had said through the prophet. The virgin will be with child and will give birth to a son, and they will call him Emmanuel, which means God with us. When Joseph awoke, he did what the angel of the Lord had commanded him and took Mary home as his wife. But he had no union with her until she gave birth to a son, and he gave him the name Jesus. Let us pray. Lord, I thank you for sending Jesus to save us from our sins and to grant us salvation. Thank you for choosing Mother Mary and Joseph to fulfill your plans. Give me a willing spirit, just like Mother Mary, to always say yes to you, even when things are difficult. Jesus is the Emmanuel, and he is the great reminder that you, my God, are always with us. Stay with us during this month and bless us during December. Just like the star that was sent to the shepherds to lead them to you, may your love and your light bless us and gently guide us towards you into eternity. Amen. Finally, we end this prayer by asking Infant Jesus to bless us. Away in the manger, no crib for a bed, the little Lord Jesus laid down his sweet head. The stars in the bright sky looked down where he lay, the little Lord Jesus asleep on the hay. The cattle are lowing, the baby awakes, but little Lord Jesus, no crying he makes. I love you, Lord Jesus. Look down from the sky and stay by my side until morning is night. Be near me, Lord Jesus. I ask you to stay close by me forever and love me, I pray. Bless all the dear children in your tender care and fit us for heaven to live with you there. Let us pray. Lord, as I meditate on your birth, I am reminded that you did not have a comfortable bed when you were born. Mother Mary and Joseph could not find any place other than a manger. You were born among animals in very humble conditions. Forgive me, Lord, for all the times I have taken the comforts of life for granted. Make me realize that I need to help the poor. As you bless me during this month of December, help me donate and be a blessing to the poor and the needy. Let me donate my time and or money to the children who are orphans and those who have no one to care for them. 
when I give and be a blessing to others, I know that you will bless me. Amen. Friends, I pray that God will hear your prayer for this month of December. Say this prayer for the next seven days. Share this prayer with someone who needs God's blessing for the month of December. Subscribe to get inspiring prayers. Click on the bell button and select all. Thank you for joining me in prayer. And may God be with you throughout this month of December.